In this video, we are going to discuss about basic configuration of routers and switches. So, here there are some features like the host name, the clock, the banner and the passwords. These features are these features, features are not very critical to the functions of the router, but these make the administration easier and give security to the router. So, coming to the host name. So, you can set the host name of the device without affecting the functions of the router. So, you can see this is the command we use host name gateway, it gets into the gateway configuration mode, then host name my router. You can give any name. So, here I have given this as my router so that the router name will come as the host name as my router. So, you can see the next one is about the clock. You can set the date and time of the clock so that it helps in the troubleshooting of your router and also it has to be do in the privileged executive mode here. So, setting the correct time and date is the requirement of your router because in advanced configuration so that it helps in the troubleshooting of the device. You can see my router clock set to so and so time, so and so date and so and so year. So, coming to the banners, banners are message displayed to the user so that whenever whoever tries to access your router without any permission so that the banner will show that it, it is an unauthorized access. See clearly it can be done in various lines like console, VTY and auxiliary and also through dial ups here. So, banners are usually to display messages prohibiting the unauthorized access and this is the syntax basic for the creating the banner. So, configuration mode banner MOTD hash. So, enter text message so end with the character hash so that no authorization access is the display banner which will appear whenever whoever tries to access the router. So, this can be done in two different ways here. You see here the this example you can see that if you change dollar sign every the entire it will come in the entire line here. So, entire line in the sense not in two lines or three lines if you want to display the banner in a single line. So, you use a dollar sign. So, using dollar sign you get the message displayed in a single line. You can see the syntax here. You can see banner MOTD dollar welcome to my router no unauthorized access dollar. So, putting dollar in the, in the first and the last will make this in a single line. So, the following output shows and also you can give a command like console 0 is now available. So, that whenever tries to access your router you get this message as welcome to my router no unauthorized access. So, by this you can give the banner to the person or prohibited access or else you can create passwords also. So, how to create passwords we will be discussing in the next video.